Hello, guys. I'm Graham Buller, the BSCI Master, but you can just call me Graham. And welcome to another review. Today, for this review, we're going to be reviewing this. The Battle for Dream Island Official Character Guide. Now, I actually got this book for Christmas of 2019. But it got a little old and torn, so I ordered a new one from the Jack and Jelfie website, and it turned out pretty good. So today, I thought I'd do a review on this book. So yeah, here's the front cover. It's got fiery, leafy pencil, pin and bubble. Pretty cool. Scholastic publishes book. Wow. Oops, a page ripped. It's okay, I'll fix it. And there's a wheel of the contestants. Battle for Dream Island Official Character Guides, Galactic Game, Jack Delvey. And here's the copyright. Taco, Grassy. Here's the introduction. There are four seasons of BFDI. Well, there's now five seasons. Teapot is actually the fifth season. So yeah, here's Jack and Jelfy. Oh yeah, that's the idea for BFDI, an elementary school project. And here's some of the characters. We got Flower, Fanny, TV, Rocky, Cloudy, Black Hole, and Bommy. Oh, and right here we got Loser and Gelatin. We've also got Fiery, Teardrop, and Spongy. And they were actually part of the school project that Carrie made. He called it Water Sponge Fire because it was still. It, could, it says here that he found it silly that paper could kill a rock by covering it. I think Water Sponge Fire makes a lot more sense. But I still like Rock Paper Scissors. Alright, here's Ions. We got Flower, Ruby, Pencil Match, Bubble, Lightning, Fanny, and Snowball. Ions. <laughs> so yeah, here's the history. Here's some fun, fun facts about the team. And here are some fun facts about the characters. I'll just share what I like about them. Oh, here's Ruby. Ruby eats more sugar than in one day than the others do in a month combined. <laughs> Pencil one total fiery island. Yeah, I know that. Match fears gaming devices. Whoa. Okay, let's turn the page. <laughs> this one I like. Fanny hates when people read random trivia facts about her. <laughs> That's funny. And here's the losers. You got four friends, Pin, Coiny, Fiery, and Needle. And the newcomers, Loser, Eggy, Cake, and Clock. So, if they're not friends, they must be enemies, I'm presuming. They're just newcomers. They're, Pin, Fiery, Coiny, and Needle are the old contestants. Whatever, I'm not making a whole lot of sense. Here's the history, and here's some fun facts about the team. Coiny's not actually a penny. I didn't know that. Neil has three eyes. Ooh, Fiery has a lot of interesting facts. Oh, he's the lightest of all BFDI characters. I know that. He's only weighed down by his limbs. Okay, not much to say here. This is pretty normal. And here we are with Team Ice Cube. We got Jelton, Barf Bag, Spongy, Fiery Jr., Bommy, Donut, Naily, and Bracelet. Ice Cube is not on this team. Yeah, right. There's Nailing again. The history. There's the... There's the fun facts. Gelatin is claustrophobic. I actually heard that on a break of BF... A video of the break of BFB. From... I forget what the name was called, but I'll put the link in the description. Oh, yeah. This part made me crack up. Fiery Jr. is the blightest of all BFDI Jr. characters, only being weighed Jr. down, Jr. by Jr. his Jr. limbs, Jr. Jr. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. Sorry guys, I just love that quote. I mean, I just love that fact. It's so funny. When Bart back feels like throwing up, she cannot use herself to click Bart because that will have no effect. Okay. Every time Nail uses the pun, Nail says she loses one friend. Oh, first love at Ice. Bracelet, he thinks that Ice Cube deserves more screen time. 
Yeah, I think Ice Cube needs more screen time, too. She's a pretty nice and cute character. And I think she needs more online, too. Because she hasn't really talked that much in BFB and now Teapot. And, yeah, she got her normal self back in Teapot. Just saying. All right, here's Death Tag. We got Black Hole, Pen, Remote, Lie, Pie, Pillow, Tree, and Bottle. Here's the, here, here's the, all right, here's the history. Here are the fun facts. Oh, yeah, I like this one. Uh, Bottle misheard the name Battle for Dream Island and was confused to why she wasn't given Dream Island. I like that one. Pen, Pen gets jealous every time he sees Pencil erase something. Yeah, I like Pen. He's a cool character. Pie knows the digits of pie. All of them. Whoa, that's pretty creative. All right, we got free food here. These yellow face markers, JV puffball fries, foldy bell, and eraser. Eraser looks a little sus. Just saying. I don't want to guess reference. Anyway, here's the history. <laughs> the only two on the team is fries unless you eat staplers. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. Alright, here's some fun facts. Oh, I like this one. One of Puffball's dreams is to lose the ability to fly and gain limbs, even if just for a day. Yeah, it looks like Puffball already has limbs. <laughs> the words created limbs for her. That's pretty creative. When you put 12 boys together, you can put it, you can make a dodecahedron. Yeah, I actually saw that on the How to Fold Your Foldy video. Stapy doesn't like being called Stapy, but doesn't think connecting people is worth the time. Up oh, there's Belle. Belle can ring whenever she is. There's it. Wow, my worker likes to write gamer on his arms. He must like to write a lot of things on his arms. Oh, his racer. Oh, he. Yeah, he doesn't like one sort of cake, and we don't know what it is. Oh, Yellowface has never used any of his products. The one I'd use is the box of paper slips, because I want millions of dollars. The bubble transformer? Nah, I don't want to die. The revolutionary headphones? I don't want. Uh, that might make me die, too, because I want to be able to turn the volume down, and they can't get removed, so I wouldn't buy the Revolutionary Headphones or the Bubble Transformer. But the box of paper slips I would definitely buy. Sorry, this is taking too long. Alright, here's Beep. You got Robotti, Cloudy, Balloony, David, Rocky, Leafy, Nickel, and Woody. Rocky's actually going to be the new plush. He's going to be sold as a BFDI and I meetup, which is only in a week. And yes, I am going to the meetup, and I hope to get the Rocky plush, along with the light bulb plush from Inanimate and Sandy. Anyway, here's Beep's history and the fun facts. Eh. Eggs. <laughs> oh, this one I like. Leafy always loses on her 73rd game of tic-tac-toe, and she doesn't know that. Robotti's chest compartment has been opened as many times as Teardrop has spoken. I didn't know Teardrop could speak. When when Rocky had to bake a cake, both Flower and the answer gave his score 10 out of 10. Wow, Rocky must put effort into his cake. Oh, there are Nichols' catchphrases. I plan to use one of them on my remake of the BMDI show. But all three, maybe, maybe not. Oh yeah, that line was from... Episode one. Oh my god, look at all the Davids. Oh, seriously? Alright, here's a better name than that. We got TV, Robot Flower, Tennis Ball, Golf Ball, Grassy, 8-Ball, Basketball, and Blocky. Oh, here's Golf Ball from BFTIA, or the first season of BFTIA. Uh, one of the two seasons. But look at her. She looks so funny. <laughs> Anyway, here's the team's history and some fun facts about the team. That's pretty normal. Eight balls never count into nine. Hmm. Oh, this one, like, basketball sometimes worry that she might be too bouncy. Yeah, that was stated in the first episode of BFB. Wow, tennis balls great at tightrope walking. I never knew that. 
Yep, we all know Blocky. Huh? Despite massively successfully a successful. No, no, no. Let me say it again. <clears throat> Did you know, despite being massively successful among friends, Blocky's original prankster series, Blocky's Funny Doings International, is not actually international. Oh, I like this one, too. Grassy is not afraid of lawnmowers, which only give him a haircut. Yeah, that makes sense. Here's the final theme. Blah, or eight names at once. Here's Lollipop, Ice Cube, Book, Gaty, Teardrop, Saw, Taco, and Dora. Here's the history and the fun facts. Book is actually a copy of the official character guide. Wow, I can't believe I actually have Book. I don't know if I need, still need the Book plush or not, but I really hope Book gets a plush still. Oh, Ice Cube, yay. Ice Cube regrets escaping the TLC because it's given her a criminal record. Uh, yeah, we already read that. Lollipoop. <laughs> Oh, yeah, this one I like. Saw wants, when Saw wants to nibble on snacks, she has to be careful about which set of teeth to use. Okay? That's Dora's Island song. Okay, this, the rest is pretty normal. And here's a quiz about the characters and the tips for creating their, and Carrie's tips for creating someone's object show. And here's the last page with all the contestants. So, yeah, and also here's the back cover. We got a razor, teardrop bell, palmy pen, bottle, woody, and book. Standing on that thing. I don't know what it is. It's a classic logo again. And, uh, yeah, guys, that's going to do it for my review of the BSDI book. I know I didn't read the whole thing, but if you want to read the rest of it, go to Jack and Delphi's website and purchase the book yourself. I'll also leave a link to that in the description of this video. So yeah, guys, this is actually a very good book, and I really recommend you buy it if you're a fan of the FDI. So yeah, that's about it for this video. Please make sure to like this video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you know when my videos come out. So yeah, that's it for this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys!